Okay, teachers, I'd like to show you how to use Vocaroo, which is a website that lets you make audio recordings so that if you need to, you, re you can record a spelling test or a quiz or a test, and you can share that MP3 audio recording in Google Classroom to the students in your class who need to have it. Vocaroo is a website. It's V-O-C-A-R-O-O dot com. When you get there, you will need to click the puzzle piece to enable Adobe Flash and say allow and it will also ask you for permission to use your microphone and you need to allow that as well. Once you click record, it's going to ask you for microphone access, the green check, that teeny tiny button, and you are recording. Uh, so if you use your Chromebook, you'll be able to just speak directly into that microphone at the top of the screen and on a desktop computer you would need to add a mic in order to do it that way. Um, when you're done recording, click stop. You can click this play button and listen to yourself and check and make sure it sounds good. And if you're happy with the way it sounds, click here to save. You can see I have some saving options. I'm going to choose download as an MP3. If I am on my Chromebook, then I'll just tiny pause button. that. There it is right there. Those three dots are where you go to actually download it on your Chromebook. You can send it directly to Google Drive. On a desktop machine, you'll need to do that extra step where you save it to the desktop or your H drive, and then you upload it to Google Drive to have it be there. Once you have a mp3 file saved, you're ready to share it with the students who need it. So I'm going to go to Classwork and create, just like I share everything in Google Classroom, um, I can share it as a material or an assignment. And you can see I do have the option here to choose among my students which students this audio file is going to be available for. You can go down here and click Drive. And if you go to your Recents tab, your Vocaroo recording should be right at the top. And you just simply need to click Add. And now it is ready to share with your students. Yeah, I gotta give it a title first. Now it's ready to share with your students and post in Google Classroom. All right, teachers, have a great day.